Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to House Flipper on the PlayStation 4 Pro. All right, so if you guys recall, we left off in the previous episode working on this house that we bought. We're going to flip it. I believe we did all that on camera, right? The, yeah. Uh, the bathroom. This, I think I painted off camera. Yes, Jinx painted this off camera. So that's the way this room looks. Needs some furniture. Needs furniture, and then if you're going to mount that uh, radiator there. We also just painted this room here. I think it was, was it like sand something? Sand almond. Sand almond. So we just painted this. And uh, then there's the last room, the main room, that still needs to be painted. So basically that's what we're going to do in this episode, guys, is we're going to be doing uh, painting the big room here, and we're going to be doing furniture so we can sell it. Sell it. And the plan is to hopefully sell it in this episode. That's what I'd like to do. We'll leave this as the office. I'm just going to add a lamp and an operable lamp, I should say, mm -hmm. and that radiator and then leave it. And then this will be be what it is. Yep. And we're done. Right, so a $4.21 <laughs> lamp. So nice. Mm-hmm. So while Jinx works on the room here and gets the radiator put in all, you're going to leave that couch in there? Yeah, it's fine. It's a futon. Okay. <laughs> it's a guest room slash study. Yeah, I guess like when you're working hard, a long day of working, mm -hmm. you need to take a little nap. You don't want to wake up your wife coming to bed at like 7 o'clock in the morning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can just lay down. And then right that becomes there. your life. <laughs> yep, and then you're just sleeping in there from here on out and you have no sex life anymore. And... <laughs> Sounds terrible. It does sound terrible. <laughs> I don't know. We should leave this Good thing in here, to Jinx. You. Yeah, we're going to ruin marriages. <laughs> we need to take this thing out. Uh, but yeah, as Jinx does this here, I just want to let you guys know, I'm like super tired today. Uh, and we have a, a lot of plane going overhead you as well. You can tell. Um, he sounds a bit sleepy. Yeah, I'm, I'm so tired, guys. I had a an appointment uh, this morning, which my appointment was a, about when I typically go to bed. <laughs> so it was like an hour... Uh, after when I typically go to bed, you know, because I work the night shifts. So I go to bed, you know, early in the morning, uh, typically, you know, maybe six. Yeah, you know, I gotta try and shoot for six in the morning. Sometimes it's the latest seven. It depends on how long it takes to get put videos up and stuff if I'm working on those uh, before I finally go to sleep. And so my appointment was, it was like eight something. Really yeah. early. It was him. really early, man. <laughs> so I didn't sleep much beforehand. And it's a long appointment too. I had to get my uh, gallbladder scanned, and so you're just sitting on this table while the <laughs> machine scans you Were for you like. Naked? No, I wasn't naked. I thought I was gonna be naked. I kind of was all like ready to get, you know, in that gown, had my ass hanging out, and all that kind of stuff. Uh -huh. I was prepared for it. They're like, I was ready. Can you put your clothes back on? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just started stripping. They looked at me. Whoa, what are you doing? <laughs> No, nah, they they uh they told me right from the get go that well, I wasn't gonna have to. Well, every time I go to the doctor, they make me get naked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they didn't make me though. They uh they said, ah, oh, you can keep all your clothes on, everything. I was like, oh shit, all right. Uh, so yeah, they just have you sit on this table as they scan you, and it's long, guys. It's hours, man. And they give you some medicine to get you like super hungry, uh, so to get your gallbladder working. And so your body's like convinced that it's eating and it needs to be processing food, but it's not processing food. <laughs> so it, it results in you getting like really hungry. Like you get all the hunger pains. Like imagine the hunger pains like times two and uh, like normal hunger pains. And yeah, I was just like starving sitting on this table for two hours. Yeah, that sounds terrible. I did sleep through most of it though because uh, I was so tired. I, but it wasn't like quality sleep. Mm -hmm. You know, it's that where you sleep like five minutes and then wake up and sleep another five minutes, wake up again. So yeah, I don't feel rested, but, but yeah, I'm a little bit tired, guys. So I just want to let y'all know that here in the beginning. He's a bit groggy. Yes, that I am quite tired. Uh, I needed a, if I had gotten home in time, I would have went back to sleep. But by the time I got home, it was when I usually get up. So I was like, ugh, that's going to fuck my whole schedule up, man. Mess my whole world up. We're going with birch. <laughs> I know. All right. <laughs> Trying to figure I, out. What I suppose color it I looks wanted. fine, although I don't know. It doesn't fit. The, the dark brown one fit more with the. I know. The color but of the it was room. A reddish. But... So it didn't really go with the bed at all. 
So is this like how the room's going to look? Or are you putting something else on the wall? Maybe a decoration? Yeah, it's going to put a decoration picture? and a side table. Okay, yeah, you're going to have that side table. stand. For your lube. Yeah, got to have a stand for your lube. Yep, that goes right in that drawer there. And then on the top of the nightstand is where you put your water. Pine can go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> phone to wake you up everybody uses the phones for alarm clocks you remember alarm clocks yeah i do we, we used had to. a few that were faulty <laughs> <laughs> when the whole phone thing first you know happened where everybody started using their phones for their alarm clocks i didn't trust it for a while so i had an alarm clock and i used the phone it was like mm -hmm. i was just doubling up make sure that i got my ass up but yeah, now I... Because you can't uh, trust these phones. I trust my phone now. <laughs> unless we use it. We use it now for the alarm clock. But yeah, I remember I remember alarm clocks, man. That annoying sound and I'd smacking make it, them around. And, I'd worry about your guys' ears. <laughs> <laughs> I've chucked my fair share of, of alarm clocks in my day. Like, I wish that they would tell you how big the picture is. Mm-hmm. When you put so you know what you're yeah what you're getting. I mean, the ones in the little frames are typically smaller, but mm -hmm. like I need to know how big. Some sunflowers, maybe. Eighty-one dollars. So nice. Jesus. How come it won't fit on the wall there? I think it just won't flip. Oh, oh okay. There we go. Oh, it's just flipping out right there. I didn't like that wall. No, it doesn't. Fine, I guess you can go on this one. This this picture's got an attitude, guys. <laughs> yeah, it does. It's gonna ruin marriages too. He's gonna be like, "That's why I sleep in the office because your stupid fucking sunflower picture." <laughs> it's it disturbing. Creeps me out. Uh -huh. so that bedroom's done. All right, so the bedroom's done, the office is done, the bathroom's done. done. We just need to take care of the kitchen slash living room. And this area. place needs some work. Goodness. Where do we start? What do you have for the back door? Is that a glass back door that you put yeah, in Yeah, it's a sauna door. Oh, okay. I don't think that's what it's meant for, but... That's what it we're using it for. It so, yeah. Should we do furniture first or paint? Um, I guess we'll do the paint first. Okay. So you kind of know what kind of furniture you want based true. on the color that the you paint the walls. The furniture's so limited, though. Just true. I find myself, like, wanting to pick out, like, a, a main piece of furniture and then... And then paint. Yeah. Are we going for neutral or something bright and crazy? Oh, you're the stylist, Jinx. You tell me. You tell me. I've been telling you. <laughs> well, you know me. I'm. Pick a color. I'm kind of boring. You want to do some to... pistachio green? That looks terrible. Let's you... get crazy. Nobody's gonna want this house, Jinx. <laughs> Purple. Anything but sleepy blue. Sleepy. We blue? don't need no sleepy blue no. up in here. I'm already sleepy enough. How about the bliss, Zora Bliss? Ooh. That's super bright. That is super bright. It's going to be like a club, man. Let's do it. It matches the chairs. <laughs> Good eye. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did that intentionally, of course, guys. Of course. Mm -hmm. Ooh, the paint's like leaking out of the can. Mm -hmm. It's sexy. radioactive. Woo, that's blue. So Jinx has been trying to work on her double painting a bit I, more. I just don't like it. I don't even use it in my game. Mm -hmm. But a lot of people brought it up. In the yeah, comments, so I she's know. been trying to work on it. I'm trying to make you guys happy. To I'm be sorry. to be better at the the double painting, because she does do where she's often double painting and she's painting something she already did. Now we don't have to worry about her wasting paint because of that, because she does have that skill where the paint doesn't get wasted. But yeah, I could definitely see why you would think that it was wasting paint. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it is also Maybe it is slower. Paint. I don't of course, know. It does seem like I can paint less walls. <laughs> I, huh. I just get crazy. Well, yeah, I, I don't think so. Just because of it, you know, the skill says that you don't waste paint True. on something that's already been painted. So, unless it lied. I guess the game could lie. Can't trust robots. I always feel that way about paradox games. <laughs> <laughs> like when they it says it does something, mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't trust it because I've been in the code. I used to mod, you know, their games. So I've been in the code before, and I know that like. It lies. <laughs> it doesn't always you tell you the truth. Me. Yeah. And the game tells you that it, this does this or whatever, and it doesn't. It, and sometimes it's because of the bug. Sometimes it's just because I didn't update a tooltip or something. I find myself very distrustful. Ooh, that's blue. That is very blue. <laughs> I like it, though. There's going to be lots of parties happening. Mm -hmm. Are you going to paint the whole room this? No. The whole? Because no. that just seems a bit much. Yeah, that's a lot. We need a neutral color to balance mm -hmm. that. Oh, you're not going to finish it? What? No. 
It's just gonna be like the the kitchen dining room area. Okay, well, I thought you'd do right th that that area right there. No, I was gonna paint that the neutral color. Okay. Unless you want it blue. Do what you Let's want. Do Jinx. the whole damn thing. What is blue. what is roll with what you're gun going to do? I don't want to be at fault here if nobody wants to buy my house. <laughs> I thought you were going to go raspberry. <laughs> <laughs> Should I? No, probably not. Not if you're looking for something neutral. That's not neutral. It's neutral to me. <laughs> uh, I can go like some cocoa. I just want to paint everything gray. Like, you know, the saying, paint the town red. I would paint everything gray. Silver glacier. Silver goes quite well with blue. Yeah, in that's my opinion. what's in our um, office thingy. Uh huh. In the game, that's what color our walls are. Oh, you're talking about the, the uh, office where we have our office. Yeah. Now, so one thing that was brought up in the comments, and and we did we did know this, but we haven't mentioned this ever in the series, is that you can you can change any house to your office. Yeah. Uh, so you don't have to be stuck in that in that you know starting place forever. Yeah. You, we could make this our office if we wanted to. Now we're not going to because this ain't our house. Nope go here of course and we saw what it looked like before yeah there's, you know there's still bugs living in these fucking walls there's no True. way there's no way that that vacuum got rid of all those bugs as long as they don't come out when the sellers are here, or the buyers <laughs> the are buyers here. are here yeah Just stay their ass in their little cubby hole like if you're good and you stay in your cubby then i'll leave you out some snacks when we leave. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh so uh it's super tuesday today here we're recording this on the tuesday that is going to be coming out uh, so probably the video might be out a little bit late uh, but again our whole schedule is kind of thrown off with that appointment because i had forgotten about it uh, naturally well yeah because i scheduled it a while ago and you know you got to schedule well ahead with these things because they never have any days available especially ones that fit your schedule you know and everyone in this city has tummy troubles mm -hmm. yeah yeah it seems like well it just seems like there's a very high demand and not enough supply when mm -hmm. it comes to the medical services in the city and the specialists yeah particularly specialists typically when you do an appointment for a specialist it's often months in the future uh, but anyway so i'd forgotten about it so our whole schedule is thrown off today but yeah we so that's why we're recording this on the day of uh, we typically try to record our videos the day prior a little bit easier for us uh but yeah so this is super tuesday uh and that means a lot of states are having their uh, primary elections and uh, I'd love to hear well I know some people don't like sharing this information but if you'd like to share it I'd love to hear who you voted for uh, our state this is the the first presidential election here in Colorado where we're able to vote in the primaries without actually being registered for that party it's a new thing that was just passed in I think 2018 is when they passed it uh, and and this is oh, this is the first time that we're gonna be able to to vote in a primary because we're not a registered Republican or a registered Democrat, so we couldn't I'm vote. I'm independent. Yeah, so we weren't able to vote in the last one. So this is the first time we get to vote in one, and you can only vote in one. And apparently, a lot of people in Colorado haven't figured that shit out. I can't read good. <laughs> yeah, like it tells you straight up, big, big, big words on there. Only turn in one of these. You can't vote in both. Uh, but yeah, a lot of people apparently voted in both, and then that just nullifies their vote. Uh, they can't count either of them. The school system isn't great around here. <laughs> no, not really. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna vote obviously in, for the primaries. We're gonna vote in the Democratic primary because there's no point of vote, voting in the Republican one. Obviously, Donald Trump will will be the the uh, candidate for the Republican Party. So we're gonna vote in the, the Democratic one, and and we, we gotta actually turn it in today, right after we finish this this uh, video. And I still don't know who I'm gonna vote for yet because I don't actually. I'm not going to actually vote for any of them for, for president. I'm not going to vote for Donald Trump either. Just put that out there. Uh, but yeah, when it comes to the uh, the Democrats, like I've been following them and none of them are very impressive, honestly. So now we just got to like figure out who's like, who's the prettiest turd <laughs> <laughs> amongst the turds. It just, it's just sad when you have two, two parties and neither of them can put forth any candidates that excite you, you know, which I know some people love some of these candidates. Obviously there's some Bern Bernie supporters out there. Very enthusiastic. Some people also just like turds. Some people like turds, right? 
I put the blue away and I didn't yep, finish it. You didn't finish it. Yes, of course. I always paint houses drunk. <laughs> <laughs> like she's all over the place. Mm -hmm. This paintbrush is out of control. It's insane, guys. I just let the paint move through me. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, I, I would love to know what your guys' opinion on, on the election is. I like talking politics. Maybe head over to our Discord channel. Uh, there's a link down in the description of any of our videos. We have a little political section. I like talking to you guys about politics. Uh, I do have... Leave me alone. Yeah, I do have a, a degree in political <laughs> science. So, I mean, I liked it so much that I decided to get a degree in it. So that tells you where I'm at. <laughs> so I like talking about politics. I enjoy having good discussions about it. Less and less people seem to be able to do that these days, though, without getting angry and irritated and frustrated, especially if you don't agree with them. Are you going to need to buy one thing of paint for each of those now? Yeah. Oh, so close, man. It That's is, unfortunate. Yeah. I mean, they're not much money. money. No, and you can always sell it to get the money back for what you don't use. Yeah, whatever's left in the, the bucket. Just kind of a pain that we're so close. Yeah, we were so close. This happened in that room, too, with the uh, the sand almond. Mm -hmm. We had like a couple squares left, and we ran out of paint. Well, I got that used 40% less paint mm -hmm. perk like when we were in that room. Yeah. So if we had had it in the beginning, I think we could have finished it. Could have got through the room. Yeah. All right, so I think I got all the spots. You got all the window spots? I think so. Those are the ones that always get you. Yeah, I think you nope. got her. Oh, did you it's miss just one? a different color gray. All right, so everything's gray. Oops, corner here. Oh, yeah. Because that's ugly. Yeah, you got that brick in there. I was going to say, in the kind of like hallway area where you had where you have the transition into the other color paint, mm -hmm. Like, did you? does that look good to you? No. <laughs> Might want to check that and see if there's anything we want to do. In regards to to how that looks, right, so I think yeah, I think you got everything over yeah, here. It's all gray. But yeah, over here though, like I think that it like it looks odd. You see how it turns color right there on the right? Yeah. No, no right there. Oh yeah, yeah like that yeah, spot. Like that should be gray. Yeah, like that should be gray. Okay. And does it? How about the other side? How's that look? Yeah, maybe like do that too. And then you might want to do the top. No, we'll have it like blend. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. I just really don't want to paint all those tiny little spaces. Oh, that's what it is. Because yeah, they're each little square. Yeah, they're each a little square. And, it, yeah, and they all use the same amount of paint, it's too. It's artsy. Oh, and then what? Yeah, we need to finish out the blue. Mm -hmm. So you have to buy more blue paint. Buy more blue paint. What was that? Party, party that was blue? Bliss, yep. Yeah. Happiness. Ooh, that's so blue. I mean, that does make me feel kind of happy. It does. And some people will see blue and they feel depressed, but this is not a depressed blue. This is a happy blue. Well, there's a certain blue that is extremely depressing. Yes. Like that prison I mean... school blue <laughs> or insane asylums. Mm -hmm. They love to use that sad. It's probably sleepy blue. That's the one. This is that birthday blue. Mm-hmm. That's what makes me think of, like, like a inch, little kid's inch, birthday inch, party. Inch. No, no, not oh. really a club. It's no? more like a birthday party. <laughs> Doesn't it look more like birthday party blue. Uh, like a birthday party going oons, oons. Like a big. Well, I'm thinking more like a kid, like a, a big old blue cake that's gonna make you sick and make your poop oh, blue because there's so much blue yeah. dye in it. You're gonna be pooping blue for a week or at least another day. I hate those crazy colored cupcakes. Mm -hmm. Like just leave them. Leave well, and then they're so, they're so sugary. Yeah. They're so sweet, man. I guess we should get rid of some of this. Yeah, that looks like shit. It's yucky. Dishes seem fine, even though <laughs> they were covered in roaches not long ago. Jinx cleaned them with the mop, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so they're clean. It's fine. It's all fine. Oh, you said, you said you're selling all that? Yeah. And you just let the plates fall? It's fine. They're plastic. Doesn't matter. I thought they were glass. Apparently I thought they not. were too. But... They fell and they made it. So we're going to say that they're plastic, guys. Okay. Kitchen. Well, I guess I don't want to have to sell each individual dish because we can reuse them. Mm -hmm. But we do need you to get do rid the, of the cabinets. Can't you just take this stuff off and throw it on the floor? I could. 
Just throw it on the floor. Set it go. next to the plaster. Mm -hmm. It'll be fine. Yeah. So, so the plan here, guys, is that... Ah. And just leave dishes everywhere. If we finish this house to, in this episode, then this would probably be the finale episode. This is always meant to be a shorter series, just because this is a busier time of the year for us. We got a lot of stuff going on. Obviously, we still have the Hunt Showdown series, which is still getting really good views, so we're going to do a couple more videos of that. Uh, yeah, it's still getting about double the views that these videos are. So I'll probably do a couple more of those. Uh, but then later this week, there's a bunch of games coming out. I think like Thursday and Friday, there's several games coming out. We're going to cover one of them. I haven't decided which one yet. There's there's several options, though. Just kind of base it off of which one I think would be more popular and which one we'd enjoy a bit more. Uh, but yeah, we'll have to take a look at those. and That'd be exciting to start a new series. Uh, but this one would be over. Oh, you just found some <laughs> jeans inside of it? It's hiding out in there. Here, we'll go put the jeans somewhere in the bedroom. Mm -hmm. Those gotta be some roach jeans, Jinx. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine until somebody puts them on, and then they got roaches crawling up If you up buy a house, and then you find some jeans, and then you just like, put, them on. put them on. I'm gonna put them on. Without washing them or anything. And that's on you. Mm -hmm. I typically wash my clothes when I get them from the store, if they're the type of clothes that people are gonna, it's the type of try store that people on. will be trying on. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Let's see. Want something fancy. I mean, there's a lot of fancy options here from what I'm seeing. Or we could just go with this one that's already put together. Did you just pick the ugliest one? What? No, we're going to make it nice. Oh, okay. So, let's see. We got blue for the walls. Mm-hmm. We could go with the sleek black. Black and blue always fits nicely together. Ooh, a marble, huh? It's dark, though. Yeah. Yep. Shiny gray. We'll just go with white. The nice thing about having the dark countertops in your kitchen is you can't see how disgusting true. they are. True. Very <laughs> true. Can't see all the nasty crumbs that are on there. Yeah, we'll just go with white for the top. Okay, then. So we're going to put that right in there. Yeah. I like that one. You just slide it in there. You don't have to piece together the mm -hmm. little pieces. Yeah, which Jinx sometimes has some issues with. Yeah. Just a bit. Well, because it doesn't seem to snap very yeah, well. Yeah, there's no snapping. Yeah. So that no. causes some issues. Seems like it's for a short person, doesn't it? <laughs> it does seem really tiny. I'm freakishly tall. Maybe we're just really tall. Yeah, you'd have to bend over to, to properly use it. I ain't bending over in my own kitchen. <laughs> I don't know. I recall you bending over in your kitchen a couple of times, Jinx. Well, that's because I'm trying to seduce you. Wink, wink. <laughs> Where's the refrigerator's? Huh. That would be a kitchen appliance, right? You'd think it'd be in kitchens. Electronics. Home appliances, maybe? Oh, okay. Not yeah. right here. Go with the black refrigerator. That's fancy. $361. It's a skinny little fridge, though. It's only though. half a fridge. Yeah, it's really skinny. You can be able to stick much in there. Hope you don't like meat. I oh. really don't. This is a vegan house. That's a, yeah, because that, is that the freezer down the bottom part? Because yeah. that thing's tiny as shit. Yeah, that's a very tiny it, freezer. It's really weird having the freezer in the bottom, too. I'm so used to the freezer being out there on the side or the top. I feel like this is a European make. Like, we don't have a lot of radiators here, do we? Oh, well, I mean, Maybe some, it heat, depends, like, yeah. Where it's colder. We have, like, what is this, the hot air that blows through the house? <laughs> What? Yeah, not air. <laughs> well, I guess we have the central heat in there. Yeah, we have the central heat, but you don't but you don't typically find here. that in Colorado Springs, though. Mm -hmm. That's pretty rare, uh, which is one of the reasons why I bought this house. We walked in in this summer. And, and it felt so nice. It was so nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, this is the one. Well, because we had just come from that, that ghetto apartment where, like, we didn't have any air conditioning. Mm -hmm. They had this thing that stuck on the window that they called air conditioning, but it didn't do anything. It no. didn't bring any cold air in. It was just a waste of money. Pretty much just had to open the windows and let the, the wind blow in. And sometimes it could get nice with that, but typically it was just hot and miserable. Oh, and then remember we had those sun windows. Oh, and they're just oh, beaming God. down on you, cooking you. 
It seemed nice, like it looked nice, but good. Grief. Until you actually, yeah, it makes your your living room unusable in the mm-hmm. afternoon because it's just beaming sun, we had to cooking you to death. And melt. Yeah, we would record like that because you know we wanted to record when the kids are in school, like we're doing right now. You know, kids are in school right now, and so yeah, we wanted to record during the day while the kids are in school, and uh, we had to sit in that fucking sun. And if you guys have been on the channel for, I mean, this was a while back, but if you've been on the channel for a while, then you guys remember us complaining about it in videos, like mm-hmm. how hot it was or how we couldn't see at nighttime because oh, yeah, of, of the glare, because the glare was so bad. I mean, we couldn't see at night in, in when the game was at a, the game was taking place at nighttime or it was just a really dark game. Often we couldn't see anything. So we'd have to find like ways to like cut through the night and not have to play it on a, on the channel just because couldn't see shit with the glare or record at nighttime which can sometimes be more difficult to do because jinx gets sleepy i do <laughs> she's a sleeper <laughs> to be fair like i work really hard well yeah and you work in the morning too yeah. you know so we can be often be on two different schedules because like i work at night and jinx works in the morning so i don't know what it's like getting up in the morning because i i don't mm-hmm. <laughs> i go to bed in the morning uh, so but yeah, it's staying up late as shit to record, and then mm-hmm. I gotta get up. And it doesn't. I was gonna. I I stay up late anyway, so it doesn't doesn't affect me. Yeah. Can I open these? You should be able to open them. No. Oh no. <laughs> Maybe because it's that special kind. Yeah, it's just decorated. Yeah. Decorative. Well, that's, well, that's a shame. They people are gonna be very disappointed when they come here and they realize you can't open <laughs> There's any. There's no drawers. There's no drawers. All right, let's get a table. And We're almost done, I think. Well, well we have I the guess table. We do the... Are, you, are you leaving that couch and the coffee table that are already in here? No, they're kind of ugly. So yeah, we'd have to replace those. Get a new sofa. Let's see. You'd also buy the coffee table while you're in here. True. I thought that they had a nice coffee table. They might. There. I don't. I don't even remember. A simple table. Simple. Jinx likes it. We could it. do white top, black legs. Go with our kitchen. Yeah, I was gonna say. Thing. I suppose it fits with with the cabinets there. That we're gonna place a table. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't that make like the left side of the table useless? Because you can't put chairs on that side. You can stack junk mail on it though. <laughs> It's kind of a tiny table, honestly. It is. Well, we're only going to put, like, two chairs. Maybe three. Yeah, because you can put one on the at the head of the table right there. Mm-hmm. I mean, I guess you could put two on each side, right? I suppose you could. It might be kind of hard to squeeze in there. They don't care about the spacing. <laughs> <laughs> they just want to know, does it have a table in the room? How many chairs it's got? Yeah. So yeah, it'll be fine. <laughs> Might want to pick up all these dishes, You're just yeah. stomping all over them and shit. We're not gonna clean them either. I don't know why you would have like your table permanently sat. <laughs> uh, you just have plates sitting on your table. Like yeah, I'm gonna use those for dinner. Are those just decoration? Like I don't understand. Do people that. do that? Yeah, like in fancy houses, uh-huh. like they'll have their table set. Like always set. Yeah, maybe they just don't use that table. Like, this is where we would eat if we spoke to each other. Mm -hmm. But we have to eat in separate rooms because we don't like each other. Yeah, eat at the bar or something. (laughs) Or in the office. Mm -hmm. Or in front of the TV. There's too much work to do. So that's misleading because those two plates are on the table like they're clean. (laughs) While the other plate is in in the sink like it's dirty and Mm -hmm. that's confusing that would make me believe that you had cleaned all these dishes, Jinx. It's fine. Are it you gonna sell that chair? Yeah. Make some money. Make a little bit of money from it. Twenty-three dollars. Ooh, that's ugly. Mm-hmm. That's ugly too. Yeah, that one's. I need some Unless work. you're going for a. Are you Are you keeping look. on these paintings? Like you'd have to obviously straighten them out, but yeah, we'll you're keep gonna them. keep them. Yeah, they're okay. fine. So yeah, the coffee table is fine. That can stay, but we definitely need. Want to get rid of whatever that is? Yeah. Like without any living room, like chill out, people. (laughs) Chill. This painting is kind of ugly. Yeah. (laughs) I mean, it's okay. 
I mean, I wouldn't put it in my, I wouldn't put it in my house, but it's all right. So what what kind of choices they got for sofas, Jinx? I'm gonna put it in the radiator and then oh. I'll look at the sofas because you can't just like throw the sofa in and then mm -hmm. disassemble yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Which like, is there a fire hazard? I don't know how hot these things get. I have no experience. <laughs> like the kids were asking how these work. They just run hot water through them, right? Oh, the radiators? Yeah. I think. I mean, I don't. To I don't know either. The, the space. I'm not entirely sure either, but I know that that's how that one worked in in our apartment uh, that we had. Mm -hmm. It was running the water through it, the hot water. But it was a little bit different than that one, so I don't I don't know exactly how that one works. All right. So, so we're to the sofa the choices, guys. I'm guessing sofa shadow is what we had. That kind of looks like what yeah. we had. Like what is this? They picked, Archaic. And they that picked the turd right. color for it. Should we pick like a bright blue couch? If they even have that. If they have that choice. They do not. They're like, let's let's give you some boring couches. I mean, there's a blue. blue. It's okay. Yeah. It's not a great couch for chilling, but. No, that's that decorative couch. Now that armchair look looks like it'd be great for chilling. That would too. I wonder if it's, there's gonna be some room for that. Maybe. Yeah, you could chill on that. You could lay out, sprawl out on there. Yeah. Part looks like it'd be great for sex too. <laughs> of course, you would go there. Mm -hmm. I mean, it would be, but. Well, every time we go to the sofa store and I see those sofas, I always think <laughs> about that. Like when we bought the car, and I was like, "You could fit so much lumber on here." When we go to buy the couch, he's like, "You could fit so much sex on here." <laughs> <laughs> yep. I'm like, that's oh, I'd true, never, I'd can. never had a couch that had one of those, so that would be my spot. I'd just sleep there. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you get that spot? This is my spot. I'm the bigger one. I guess we could put this be, one in the corner. We could probably fit on that spot together. That's what I was thinking. We'd share the spot. Oh, Jinx just automatically. Okay. That would be my spot. Yeah, we could do that. Mm -hmm. We could share. Yeah, sharing is allowed. Yeah. I, I, do, do you guys, do you guys <laughs> think that she's telling the truth here? Because I don't. And then we can get an armchair. She's trying chair. to kick me off the couch, guys. What was that armchair? This one? Uh, I mean, that one's nice. Is I there going to be room for it? It looks matches. huge. looks monstrous, man. It does look monstrous. I guess there's that big old... It's not even the same blue. Yeah, it's not the same blue. It looks weird. It does look weird. Hmm. I don't like weird. That's <laughs> true. I love weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got the zebra couch. That's a cow. No, the zebra oh. couch. Oh. It's kind of zebra. That's not a zebra couch. It's kind of zebra. That's like that old, like, black strips couch that your grandma had in the 90s. You're not going to get the sofa fudge, are you? The fudge? <laughs> it's what it's called, <laughs> sofa called. fudge. Uh, yeah. I, I mean, I guess know. it's fine with that. I thought you were going to get the cow one, though. I feel like the cow one would be the best. Really? Yeah. I, I, Let's get funky. I don't agree, but. We can get funky. Somebody might like it. I mean, shit, they're buying a house with furniture already in it. True. You're silly. There's just a lot of lounging going on in this room. Mm hmm. Who cares what color it is, right? <laughs> <laughs> is there no TVs in this game? Um, I don't know. They need one, though, don't they? Mm hmm. It's got to be in the electronics. I feel like there are TVs. There might be. You'd assume there was, but I don't recall seeing any TVs in any of the places we've been in. True. Oh, there's a wall. Oh, there's TV yeah, right there. there's TVs. Of course there's TVs. you got to have TVs. Oh, you can get, like, keyboard. It's not a living room without a TV. I didn't know I had any of this. This is nice. Yeah, you can put, like, in the office. You could have had the computer. I guess none of the jobs we've done have had, um, electronics. Mm-hmm. Yep. So which TV are you going to put in? That one. Okay. Where are you going to put it? I guess I'll have to buy a table for it. Like, there you go. $701. Like a TV in the living room? He's That's excited. awesome. He likes it. Let's buy a little table. I wish it would have came with like a pre-made. Like, you know, with the TV and yeah. the table? Yeah. That's Just one funny. option of that. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's like, what are you... You gonna put it on like a 
coffee table a type cupboard, of thing. Maybe. Small shoe cabinet. Well, it does have like TV cabinets. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's exactly nice. what I was looking for. We'll go with white. Okay. Are you putting it on that corner? Although, that's a terrible place for the TV to be. It is, but... Like, based on where the couch is positioned. Yeah. Ooh, is this going to fit? Yeah. It's, it's like our TV trying to fit on our mm -hmm. console. See, for me, I've always, like, whenever we design our... The way our living room's going to look, it's, it's all about where's the TV at and where's the couch at. True. That needs to be comfortable. But with Jinx, that's not true. Jinx doesn't really care. <laughs> she just wants... It to look a certain way, and so I sometimes. I gave up on caring though. So. Yeah, because it's important to me that you're comfortable when you're watching TV. So like the TV's got to be in a, in a in a good position, and that is not in a good. Well, position. Well, we could have switched the positions where the couch is over there and the TV's over here, seeing as the cable hookups are over here. Mm -hmm. but... Yeah, that would have been a smart way to do it too, because now you got to drag cords all the way across the room. But... I will. I think well, it they just can rearrange needs it. a lamp and a rug. They're gonna rearrange it anyway. Yeah, exactly. They're not gonna like it. Now, a game like this would get me in trouble with like DLC and stuff. Because <laughs> you'd want all these <laughs> like, different. Like, I need more furniture. So there is uh, two DLCs. Now I know one of them is like a garden one, like for you know exterior. The yard, because yeah, you can't do anything with the yard. Yeah, so that's one of the DLCs. I don't know what the other one is though. Uh, I think it's a HGTV, like, kind of stuff pack. Oh, okay. Like, they teamed up with HGTV mm -hmm. yeah. to do a DLC for it. I see. Which is pretty big for them, I guess. Love HGTV. I don't watch it as much as I used to, but... So, is it dark outside? Yeah. I think it's, like, I didn't know almost it. 11 o'clock. I didn't think I knew that it had a night and day cycle. It's news to me. And... I feel like we need something over here. But as far as the DLC uh, goes, I don't think it's on the, the PS4 yet. No. Uh, I think this is like Car Mechanic Simulator where it's going to you know get released a little bit later. More than likely. And whether we'd cover that or not when it comes out, uh, hard to say. I want to, just so I'll have it. <laughs> so Jinx will have it. Uh, we're always so busy around this time. Ooh, that's huge. But yeah, this is starting... Right in March, actually, even late February, in fact. Things get, you know, for our channel, get really busy. After we have a pretty calm January and then most of February, not a lot going on because the gaming industry, there's just not a lot going on. Ad revenue is real down, too, like, so you don't make much money off of your videos. So we typically find ourselves working a little bit more uh, than we usually do to kind of make up for the lower revenue. At our real jobs. Yep. So that's the way January and February are, but, uh, once you hit late February and into March, things get crazy on the, the channel. Couch. And we typically find ourselves like super busy, guys. Lots of games coming out that we want to cover. Things we're excited for. I was excited for this one. This is my life now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Jinx has been playing a lot of this. You know, she's got her playthrough, her own playthrough going. Yeah, she really likes this game. It's fun. Mm-hmm. But yeah, as far as like making videos, it's a, it's a lot of work putting the videos up, guys. You know, uh, recording them, you know, getting everything set up to record and then recording them and then editing them. Getting them uploaded, made public, and applying to comments, all that good stuff. There's a lot a lot that's entailed, or, you know, around doing it. If it was as simple as just recording, mm -hmm. then we'd be able to create a lot more content uh, if that's all you had to do. Uh, but... You end up spending about two to three times longer doing everything else than what you spent recording, so. A lot of behind the scenes mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah, a lot of stuff you gotta take care of. So that's, a lot of people be like, oh, you know, if you're, you know, enjoying this one, why not stick with it, you know? You know, it all depends on how busy you are, what we're covering and stuff. And, uh, you know, how well it's doing, views and that lamp. all that good stuff. But yeah, this, this one was always meant to be like a shorter series, guys. Since All we had right, already think, covered it once. I think this is it. <laughs> what, the, the lamp is all you need? The lamp is all I need. And then we're done here? I think so. Oh, it is like super dark in here without that, without that light. Where's the light switch? So you gotta turn them off and on again? Yeah. Ta-da! Alright, yeah, that looks, looks alright. I think we did a great job comparing it 
to how it used to look. Yeah, it did look shitty, but... So the office, are you putting in. anything in the office? Are you putting, like, a computer in there or anything? I mean, I guess we can. God, it's dark in here. I don't know. It might be a waste of money, though. True, yeah. Might just be throwing money away. Bring your own computer. Mm-hmm. But, yeah. There's a lot more we could have done with this place, but... I think it looks pretty good. Yeah. I mean, obviously, yeah, there's, there's always more you could do with it. If you want to really spend the time on it. Mm -hmm. And so much more like, you know, like the little clutter or the mm -hmm. decorative things. Yeah, the little decorative stuff that you often find in the, uh, some of the houses you do the jobs in. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think this isn't too shabby. Uh, so I, I would like to see how much is worth. Oh, Let's yeah. try selling it. Let's try selling it. Let's see how this goes. All right, so you bought the house for 47, almost 48 grand. Uh, let's just see. Room count five. Your current budget is twenty-one thousand. You're working on this house for two hours, fourteen minutes, and forty-five seconds. That's a long ass time. So let's put it on auction. Put it on auction. And so we need to make really good money on this in order to make it worth it. I and mean, it looks like we're already doubling our money here. Yes. There we go. We're at ninety thousand. And it keeps on keep going, going up. Baby. It looks like that's what we're going to sell it for, for a $40,145.39 profit. Ka-ching. That is really nice. And then, yeah, you can pick who you want to sell it to if you just don't like the winner. If you don't like the <laughs> Smoth family. Yeah. Because they're rude. Well, one bathroom is okay, but we would like bigger. Yeah. <laughs> well, then get bigger, man. Don't settle. I'm talking about how they don't like my style. Or they just <laughs> hate the colored blue. <laughs> So yeah, after you do your first auction, then you can take a look and see like what some of these people like. like. So you can kind of try to aim to sell to them or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you have the likes and dislikes mm -hmm. for each person. and Kind of controls how much stuff. they're willing to offer you. Yeah. And I feel, I don't, I haven't figured out if they're like some people pay more. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm not sure about that. Okay. But yeah, it's just kind of good to know. Like who your tailor in the house that mm -hmm. you're selling for? Yeah, like that guy. He he's just trying to get chicks. You know, he, mm -hmm. he wanted to make a room for him. A love room. A love he's like, room. He's got a love room. I'm uh huh. There. Yeah, you need like a jacuzzi there and shit. She didn't like that we didn't have a bookcase. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could see if you had a lot of books, that'd yeah. be a problem. Now, I don't see why that would affect your bookcase, house <laughs> choice here, because I mean you could always buy your own damn bookcase. But. Too many rooms for the old people. <laughs> Chicks like expensive house equipment, so okay. your stuff wasn't expensive enough. Damn. Okay. <laughs> and you also too worried about not being able to fit enough people in that living room for party town. Parties, girls, and alcohol. Mm -hmm. A double bed will come in handy. <laughs> well, it. That's well, what it. he said. <laughs> oh yeah, two bathrooms. House is gonna have two bathrooms. <laughs> he doesn't eat food. He actually so. likes the bathtub. You chose though. And he said, but I feel a bit strange. <laughs> I feel a bit strange here. I feel a bit poor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. And so, yeah, you get a, an idea of the, the personality that everybody has here, mm -hmm. kind of things they like. And we're back. So, if somebody time. buys a house, does that take them off the market? Like they don't need a house no more? Or are they going to still be on the market and want think another the house? People are. You, just that house is not there anymore yeah i was just thinking like you know the, the people like because they've already bought a house yeah they need i think to buy they'll keep one? buying from you okay and i did find out that even though we did have oh wait no never mind okay well never mind what you I got to smash something james yes <laughs> what were you gonna say i'm gonna destroy the house <laughs> uh so yeah i guess that's gonna be it for this video and for this series guys we're able to to flip our first house buy a house and sell one again I, we would like to play more because it is a very chill game and it's, uh, I don't know if it's our style. Uh, again, a lot like Car Mechanic Simulator, where it's just, you know, very, very chill. Uh, and that's the kind of games we like, man. Uh, but, uh, you know, we've got more games coming out this Friday. And, of course, we're still doing, trying to do the Hunt Showdown. And we tried to do them both at the same time, and that didn't work out very well. Uh, we've had difficulty trying to record them both. Uh, Jinx and I just don't have enough time uh, right now. Especially with me doing all that Hoi 4, which has been taking up a lot of time. You know, I'm doing like an hour of videos and, and two per day. So that's been uh, taking up a lot of my, my time. And so uh, just with the, the busyness of, of the our schedule right now, 
and the fact that, yeah, we got more games coming out this week we'd like to, to cover. There's three of them, I think, two or three, and uh, we got to pick one of them. Uh, so this is a big-ass house. Yeah, it is. Oh, man, that is nice. Like, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just a bit dated. Yeah, you could you could probably easily buy that and flip it for pretty good. Somebody said that one of, of these profit. houses had, was, like, from a, a drug dealer mm-hmm. or something or a crime boss, and it has a safe full of money in it. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, that's cool. I don't know which one, though. Hmm. That's kind of interesting. They have, like, little different uh, stories and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to like any like DLC that they mm-hmm. put out for it because I am there for this game. <laughs> and maybe if it comes out and we have the time, we have something open our schedule, maybe we can cover the DLC, guys. Do a couple quick videos. Uh, but again, this is this is a shorter series, and uh, we had fun with it though. I yeah, liked it. I did. I love the chill atmosphere, mm-hmm. just sitting around painting stuff. Mm-hmm. Oh God. This it's, is our daughter's dream home. Yeah, that is pink. Just throw some cats in there. <laughs> <laughs> our daughter would love it. Uh, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and end the series here. I'm glad that we were able to flip a house since it is house flipper. Yeah, we, uh, we did flip it. Yeah, we were able to buy the house and, and, and sell it for a profit. And we made it look very nice. I think we made a family happy. Or that couple, whoever they bought it. Yeah, we don't even know. The Smoths or something like They're that. Smosh. Yeah, so I think they'll, they'll like the house. And uh, I think Jinx did a good job with it. And uh, maybe we'll come back to the, the game at another time if we, we have some, some openings. Uh, kind of like we've what we've done with a few other games in the, in the past. Because, yeah, I want to do some yard excavating. I've also been considering going back to that Car Mechanic Simulator, too, if they get some DLC. Because uh, I think I ha- we had a lot of fun with that one, too. And again, a very similar game to this one, in a way. Uh, of course, dealing with different different you know, topics. Dun, dun. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Jinx has been hiding the bathroom from you guys because she hasn't done it yet. It's it's disgusting. Yeah. Needs some work, guys. Uh, so, yeah, if you enjoyed the series, make sure you leave a like on this video. Subscribe to our channel. Hit that notification bell and leave a comment. Uh, if you're looking for any links, check down the description of any of our videos. You'll find links to our Discord if you'd like to join our community where, again, we talk about games, movies, and politics. Uh, I'd love to hear some of you guys' opinions, whether it's in the comments here or on the Discord, or on the Discord channel on the current candidates. Like, again, I have been following them, and you know, I have my opinions myself about the, all the different candidates, but so far, man, it just hasn't been an impressive field for me, which was similar to 2016 with the Republicans. I also wasn't really that impressed with anybody who's running, uh, but that's just, I think that's just the way politics are now, man. Everybody who knows doesn't want to have a part, and everybody who does want to have a part has no idea what they're doing. Uh, so uh, maybe go check out that Discord. We'd love to see you join our community there. Uh, if you're looking for anything to watch while you wait for our new series to start or waiting for more hunt videos, uh, then check out the front page of our channel. we got 2,000-something videos all sorted by genre. should be able to find something to enjoy watching. If you really like this series, maybe go check out that Car Mechanic Simulator series. Uh, where we did a lot more videos. I think we did like 16 or 17 videos for that. Uh, largely because, one, we were, we were a little bit less busy at that time when it came out because it was like in May or June or something like that. Uh, but also just because that series did incredibly well. Like, it was very, very popular. Uh, did uh, That first episode got like a ton of views, like 100-something thousand views relatively quickly. Uh, so that's a longer series. So if you like this one, maybe go check that out because uh, it's very similar in tone, especially with our commentary. Uh, where it just kind of allows us to talk about whatever as we as work on some cars. Uh, so I'll go actually link that to the end card of this video if you want to check out that series. Remember, if you're looking for any other links in addition to that Discord one, you know whether it's our Twitter and Facebook, you know all of our social media, all those are down in the description. As well as if you'd like to help support the channel, support what we do here, our PayPal and our Patreon links are down there as well. So I do hope to see you on another series, guys. And again, maybe we'll come back to this one sometime in the future. Did have fun. Uh, Obviously, Jinx had fun. And uh, I'm sure she'll be playing the shit out of this for the coming weeks. Yeah. (laughs) On her little bit of free time that she gets. All right, so that's it for this one. And thanks for watching, guys.